Hi, I'm Kira and welcome to The Disney Dish. My family and I are big Disney food fans and we love making Disney recipes here at home. Today, I'm making the green beans from Ohana at Disney's Polynesian Resort. Come along with us so you can bring a little bit of magic to your house as well. And I'm Donna with The Disney Dish. Please stay tuned to the end of the video for a fun fact about Disney's Polynesian Resort plus a bonus tip about Ohana. And remember to click the like button if you like our videos and subscribe for more recipes. Ohana is one of the most popular restaurants in all of Disney World. It's located in Disney's Polynesian Resort. The Polynesian is the original resort opened in Disney World in 1971. It's got a relaxed Hawaiian tropical feel, which makes you feel like you're on a vacation within your vacation. The last time that we stayed at the Polynesian, the parks were just closing due to the pandemic and the resorts were closing shortly thereafter. It was a very surreal time to be in Disney World. There were so few people there that I even got a glimpse at what it was like to drive the monorail. Following the reopening in June of 2020, the Polynesian Resort stayed mostly closed to allow them to do a major renovation. This includes the lobby, the monorail station, and the resort guest rooms. Prior to the renovation, the resort guest room decor had a traditional island feel to it with light green walls and a lot of woods. And the bathroom also had a retro tropical design. In the newly reimagined guest rooms, you'll see there's Moana theming that really brings this tropical decor to life in a very modern and sophisticated way. The Polynesian Villa section has remained open during this construction. The studio sleeps up to five, has a mini kitchenette, and a very comfortable, relaxed tropical feeling. The overwater bungalows are also part of the Polynesian villas. They sleep up to eight with two bedrooms and two baths, have a full kitchen, a living room, and also a patio deck outside with a plunge pool and lounge chairs where you can watch the fireworks over Magic Kingdom. There is also a fireworks view from Ohana's restaurant. Most of the restaurant features big glass walls with a view overlooking the resort towards Cinderella's castle. In the morning, it's a character breakfast with Lilo and Stitch. At Ohana, they serve this delicious pineapple bread. Keep an eye out for that recipe because we're going to be making it very soon. In the evening, it's an all-you-care-to-eat family-style feast. Similar to a Brazilian-style barbecue restaurant, Ohana features an open-fire kitchen where they grill meat, shrimp, and chicken, and they serve it to you on skewers brought to your table. Plus, it's a very fun restaurant to eat at. There's a game that I remember playing where you take a little broom and you brush coconuts across the floor for a race. Tons of music playing. It's a really fun time. And if you're celebrating something, they'll actually call you up to join in on the fun and sing to you. So while we can't be at the Polynesian right now and can't visit Ohana's, we're bringing a little Ohana home to us. We're going to start by blanching some green beans. Take one pound of fresh green beans with the ends cut off and make sure they're washed and place them into a pot of boiling water. Boil them for one minute and remove them from the boiling water. In a saute pan over medium heat, add one and a half tablespoons of oil. Add in half of a sliced red onion and cook for two minutes. Add in two chopped cloves of garlic and cook for only 30 seconds. Garlic cooks very quickly. Now add in the blanched green beans and cook them for two to four minutes. If you like them on the crispier side, go closer to two minutes. If you like them softer, go closer to four. Now stir in a tablespoon of soy sauce and a tablespoon of sugar. And salt and pepper to taste. Remove the green beans from the pan into a serving dish and top with a quarter cup of crispy crumpled bacon. 
This is a really easy side dish that brightens up any dinner. One of my favorite ways to serve it for dinner is with the meatloaf from Primetime Cafe. Give it a try and let us know in the comments how it turned out. And here's that bonus fun fact I mentioned earlier. If you're at the Polynesian and see this lady making flower lays in the lobby, be sure to stop by and say hello. She is an original employee from 1971. She was scouted in Hawaii by Disney and brought back to Florida for the opening of this resort and has been here ever since. And here's the other bonus tip about eating at Ohana's. Many people will book a reservation for around the time of the fireworks, and you can see them. However, the restaurant is pretty bright inside, so you're much better off going outside to view the fireworks from the beach. They even pipe the music in. So if you're looking to try a different recipe for a side dish for dinner, try these green beans and bring a little Ohana home to your family. You'll find this recipe and more at our website, thedisneydish.com. See you real soon! Be sure to like and subscribe for more recipes and videos.